Hi everyone, welcome to Possessed Guardians. My name is Laura and if you've not watched my videos before, this is just my journey into the paranormal world. I do recommend giving some of our other videos a watch just because it does explain a little bit about who I am, my history and my journey so far. So in the background I have Martha, Alice and my new doll Mary. Um, I haven't done any work with Mary yet, um, I literally just got her so I'm just letting her, her settle in along with the other items that I got from the Haunted Mystery box from eBay. So yeah, I thought I would share with you this evening, um, I basically got a whole bunch of dolls that someone um, was getting rid of. Um, I've not opened the bag yet, I have seen pictures of the, the dolls but I've not actually opened the bag so I thought I would do that with you guys um yeah so I don't know if there's any spirits attached um but it's going to be really interesting to to find out so yeah let's um open this bag and see what we've got I'm a bit nervous mostly I'm actually the reason I am a bit nervous is because I just have visions of like a giant spider running out um like I don't know where these items were stored before I got them and I'm, I'm a bit concerned that there might be a spider in there. And I don't know why I think that, but yeah. So I'm not actually scared of the spirits. I'm scared of a spider. Go figure. Okay, so it is a giant industrial black sack full of dolls. And um, there are some broken dolls that are in there as well. Um, I think all the dolls are in some sort of condition that require a little bit of TLC. Um, but yeah, let's... Um, look what we've got. Please don't let there be any spiders. Okay so I see lots of feet. Oh let's just grab the first one. Sorry I wasn't expecting it to be soft. Okay. Oh sorry darling. <laughs> so how cool this guy or oh, girl super interesting got a little hat yeah um A bit unusual. A bit unusual, it's very unusual. Feels quite warm. I feel like I'm in like the Lion King on that cliff bit, you know? Yeah. Let's not go there. Uh, so yeah, we've got this little guy here. I don't know why I'm saying guy, I just feel like it's a he. I will do work with all of these dolls, but I just wanted to show them to you for now. So let's pop him somewhere. There you go, buddy. Can you sit there, my friend? Oh, okay. You lie there. Okay. Oh, my little trousers falling down. Poor little thing. Oh. Oh, you need... Oh, you've got a little dent on your head. Is this little one desperately needs a bit of a clean up. Pretty mucky. He's got a little dent in his head as well. Yeah. He's quite cute. Come on. Oh, your little eyes closed. Gosh, I just don't... I'm sorry, I'm acutely aware that you can see his little legs <laughs> poking up. Okay. This little lady. She does not look happy. I think it's just because she hasn't got any clothes on and I've just paraded her 
I'm keeping her down there so that I'm just trying to save her dignity a little bit. So yeah, she's needs a bit of TLC as well. I'm going to just do her that way so that you don't see her in all her glory. She needs a good clean. Oh, sorry, sweetheart. Oh, how cute. She's got a little sister. I'm going to keep her down as well because she's not got any colour. Oh. There you go, darling. So, she is um, almost the spit of the other girl, but just a younger version. So, yeah, let's pop her there as well. Oh, gosh, I'm trying not to. There you go. Just some random accessories as well. Oh. Please don't be a spider. Okay, so there's this that needs something. Okay. Wow. We have this beautiful doll. She's very pretty. She needs her clothes need a good clean. But yeah, she's a lovely little doll. Oh, that's her feet. Okay. Oh, you <laughs> call this little guy. Is quite cute. Gosh, how interesting. So, this one she's got. Feels like it's a bit for batteries, so I think potentially she might have made noise at some point. I'll have um, I'll investigate that a little bit further. Oops, but that's that beautiful girl. Copy there, darling. Okay, so it just keeps going. Oh, your head. Oh, what's this little one? Got that cheeky smile. Her head is, oh, properly dented. I don't know if you can see it very well. Oh, she is cute though. Look at her little face. Oh. Pop you there. <laughs> a little, uh, little caterpillar thing. Interesting. Oh god. Oh, oh my goodness, sorry. Sorry, sweetheart. You feel really warm. Uh, this little little girl. So yeah, she's got an interesting haircut. So these, oh, they, they smell really musty, like they do smell quite old and they look quite old as well, just um, some of them have been very well loved. Oh, she's got such long legs. Look how long they are. Can you with your long legs? Oh, let's pop you there, darling. Such long legs. Oh, I'm 
terrified of a spider. Oh, Jesus. It's not a spider. I just, for some reason, decided there was a giant spider in there, which I wouldn't have even been able to see if it was in there. But, yeah, frightened myself. Smart person that I am. Okay. There's a bag with stuff in. And... God. Oh, my goodness. So I'm just going through the bag and just um, moving things around just to see what's in there and there's just these piercing eyes staring right at me with this pale face that matches my own complexion. Um, yeah, she's really something. Follow that thing. Oh, how beautiful are you? There it is. This girl. So. She is beautiful. Very pale. Very, very pale. Matches my complexion. You actually make me look tanned, and that's an achievement. Okay, I don't really look tanned, but... Wow. I don't know. Sorry, I was sort of thought I could see... Um, like a, a blur around her or um, some sort of aura, I don't know. Yeah, I get very strange feelings from her. Not, not negative or anything, not bad. But I definitely, mm, I think she's going to be very interesting to work with and I'm looking forward to that. Okay. Oh, you poor darling. Hello, my love. She's got one arm. Oh, sorry, I've just realised that I'm just showcasing her in all her glory. So she's got her one little arm. Little one as well. She's very similar to one of the other girls. Oh. Little basket. Oh, how cute. Little bear. Sorry, I can't see that very well, can you at all? It's a very pale little bear. Yes, that is a hat. A little one, and oh, just uh, another little hat, and then there's a bag here. I've got 
please don't let spider run out. Little panda. Another little teddy. Fluffy heart. Oh, it's not fluffy. That's completely the opposite of what it is. Another heart. Oh, oh okay. So we have some limbs. This is weird. It's got a little like. I'm trying. No idea what that is. Oh, we've got a little head. Um. Ah, we've got her body. I think. Not entirely sure that's hers. Oh no, there's another head. Oh, just a little cuddly toy. Right. Uh, another head. There we go. Another little head. I don't know why I look in the holes because if something jumped out at me, I think I would actually cry. Um, what else is in here? God, sorry darling. Another head. Oh my goodness. <gasps> Another head. Beautiful. Beautiful colouring. She's got lovely hair. Um, uh, a bird. A ooh. <laughs> little troll. What else do we have? I'm oh, sorry, my roots are terrible. Lockdown hair problems, eh? Teddy bear. And oh, oh, you're cute. That's a little girl as well. Sorry, for some reason, my lighting is being a bit uncooperative today. So yeah, that is my um, bizarre, <laughs> crazy new collection. So these do need working with. Um, not all of them are going to have anything attached to them. Uh, I definitely do get some vibes from some of them, which I think is super interesting. And I'm going to be where I work with every item. So the thing to remember is that spirits can attach themselves to anything as a vessel. It does not need to be a doll. So some of these other items could potentially have a spirit attached. I did read somewhere once that um, there was a shoe that had a spirit attached to it. So yeah, it absolutely doesn't just have to be um, dolls. I think people prefer dolls just because they are um, a bit more interesting to look at i think they're a little bit more creepier as well if you're going with the whole um scare factor i guess um i like dolls just because i think that they are beautiful um i specifically actually as a child loved ugly dolls um and by that i mean dolls that would have like a scrunched up crying face um with like snot and everything attached to them um, i remember my nan bought me this beautiful beautiful doll and she couldn't understand why i wanted it because it had the most scrunched up beautiful little crying face but i was in love with it so yeah I that's why I tend to to go for dolls but yeah I, I'll investigate anything that, that comes across my path so I am looking forward to working with these items Um, that's it for today really if you seen anything weird in this video then absolutely please comment also if you picked up any vibes from any of the dolls that I was showing 
please comment as well. I'd be really interested to hear some of your views about them. Um, if you any images came into your mind, any thoughts, any feelings, absolutely please comment below and share that with me. And especially because if, if that proves to be right, that's like super interesting as well. Um, yeah, so thank you so much for watching. Um, do give us a follow, give us a like, give us a share and pop all your amazing comments below. Um, thank you so much. Um, take care and I will speak to you soon. Bye bye.